Hi there, and welcome to CoinDuel's 8th Strategy of the Week video. This week, our strategy will utilize some more of the new technical indicators we have just integrated. These are the MACD and Exponential Moving Averages, or EMAs. This strategy will make use of one of the pre-designed MACD templates on CoinRoll. This means it will be extremely easy to set up and start trading with the strategy. Another important thing to note is that with this template, we also have an associated script on TradingView. This means that you'll be able to backtest the strategy on any coin and time frame you choose. More on that later. The MACD is a trend following momentum indicator that shows the relationship between two moving averages of a coin's price. The MACD is calculated by subtracting the 26 period exponential moving average from the 12 period EMA. The result of that calculation is the MACD line. A nine day EMA of the MACD called the signal line is then plotted on top of the MACD line. This can then function as a trigger for buy and sell signals. Traders may buy a coin when the MACD crosses above its signal line and sell or short the coin when the MACD crosses below its signal line. EMAs are a type of moving average that places a greater weight and significance on the most recent data points. The exponential moving average is also referred to as the exponentially weighted moving average. An exponentially weighted moving average reacts more significantly to recent price changes than a simple moving average, which applies an equal weight to all observations in the period. To enter trades, this strategy has two entry conditions. The first is when the MACD histogram turns bullish, i.e. this is when the MACD crosses above its signal line. If you remember what I mentioned earlier, you'll note that this is typically a buy signal. And then the second entry condition relies on EMA 8 being greater than EMA 24, just like this. The exit conditions utilize trailing take profits and stop losses. Essentially, the take profit and stop loss will adapt to price trend strength, as illustrated in this diagram. The take profit condition is a 3% price increase trailing, and the stop loss condition is a 1% price decrease trailing. Now, I'll show you how to run the strategy on CoinRoll and also backtest it using various coins and timeframes. Okay, here we are on the CoinRoll rule page. As I said, setting up the strategy is going to be super easy because it's a pre-designed template on CoinRoll. So come up here to create a rule, click Templates, come to MACD, and here it is, Fast EMA Above Slow EMA with MACD. Click this, you'll get a short description of the strategy. Click select and the template will be preloaded into your strategy here. So all you have to do is select what time frame you want the strategy to run on and the amount, of the amount you want to buy with each trade and which wallet you wanted to buy with. You can also have the strategy run on any coin in the market or any specific coin that you want. So to figure out what time frame you want it to run on, I'm going to come to trading view here, come to our trading view page and find the strategy here. I'll add a direct link to this in the description of the video so you don't need to find it manually. Um, scroll down, you'll get a description of the entry and exit conditions. This is just what we've been over, but it's here for your reference if you want to look at it again. Uh, scroll down and click add to favorite indicators. So I'm going to test this on AXS on the five minute time frame. So click indicators up here, come to favorites, and then just type in fast EMA above slow EMA and you'll see you were provided with some backtesting data. So in 41 trades, the, the rule made a net profit of 29%. So if you want to test what time frame works best, you can change this up here. So I'll check the one minute. As you can see, the profit goes down. So that suggests that this rule works better on the five minute time frame. So I'm quite happy with this performance here. So what I want to do is I want to come back to coin rule. I don't want it to run on any coin. I want it to run on just on AXS because as we've seen, it performs well. And then change this time frame of five minutes, time frame of five minutes. And then I want to buy a hundred dollars of that coin every time a buy signal is generated. I want to buy it with my USDT wallet. Come down, I want to execute a hundred times in total. Check if you're happy with it. So I need to set this to USDT as well. If you're happy with this, just click launch. Oops, sorry, I need to also add the USDT here. And there we go, click launch. You get a preview here. And your strategy is now live. Thank you very much for listening to the strategy of the week video. Please reach out if you've got any questions. 
I'm excited to see what you create. Thank you.